I dab for no god. Hey, hey guys. guys, I made you do it. Yes. <laughs> so cringy. That took five minutes of persuasion and the promise of a Christmas present. So for all of you guys that don't know, this is my sister, whom I share genetic data with, apparently. Daniel asked you a month ago for questions. This is the video of the Q&As. Let's jump straight into it. So Rebecca asks, what birthday present would you like for your 70th birthday, Rosie? 70th birthday, a boat. Get me a boat. A boat. boat. A big old dinghy. <laughs> I, I, I can edit that into a joke somewhere. A big old dinghy. A big old dinghy. dinghy. <laughs> um, I don't know what I'd want for mine. No, I think for my 70th birthday I would genuinely just ask for more years, because let's face it, I think about death now. So by the time I'm 70 I'm going to be genuinely planning for my own demise. Nikki asks, what be your most expensive <laughs> organ body part to you if it was sold on the black market? I don't know Rosie. what to be. From a narcissistic point of view, obviously my entire body. Mine is obviously my top quality liver. That they, they regenerate. Yeah, so I could keep making money off my liver. Oh. I could like continue to harvest oh my, my God. liver. Multiple liver harvests. Multiple liver. <laughs> if you can survive multiple liver harvests, that's definitely the way to go. It's like a genuine money make. That's a good business model. Louis asks, can vampires grow hair? Consider the fact that vampires can't age. Yeah, I'm going to go with yeah. If they were immortal, so living through the centuries, styles would change. They yeah, are vain. Okay. Which is ironic, because veins are what they drink from. <laughs> if they're not vain, are they artery? <laughs> Seeing as I base most, if not all, of my vampire knowledge on Twilight, um, I'm gonna say a solid no, they don't grow hair, because Robert Pattinson's hairstyle doesn't change at all in that entire movie. Also, yes Louis, I can give a shout out to your YouTube channel. I'll leave a link to Louis's channel, which is called Poison Fang, in the description. There you go Louis. Edgy name Louis. So I don't remember who this was either because I didn't screenshot the names of the people and I can't be bothered to go back down my Facebook page to find where I did this. So someone tell me who this is. Like, let me know if this is you so I can edit the video later. Rosie, have you ever wanted to be a slug? No. I can get used to this actually. Yes, I am now thinking about being a slug. That's my, my new career path. I'm a, I'm, I'm, I'm a sluggy slug. You call look me, a fool. You can call me Heimlich. You still look a fool. Okay. Next question. Immy asks, how badly do you think you would lose to me in a Nutella eating competition? Well, that sounds like a gauntlet being well and truly thrown, doesn't it? Probably. Name the time and the place. I won't be involved. And you will be... I'll, I'll be there. I will face you down. I, I can adjudicate. I don't really like Nutella. So that's all, all the questions we've got for this week. And if you liked this kind of just little sit down with another person, then no. hit that little like button just down there and hit subscribe if you want to know when I make any more videos, which will be next week. So if you enjoyed me being on here, I have got a channel. I'm going down to London shortly to go to the National Gallery. I'll get down to put a link into the description. So yeah, if you fancy watching, that'd be nice. So we hope you have a good week. I'll be seeing you guys on Sunday and maybe this one will start bobbing in every now and again. Goodbye. Bye.